Hey everybody, it's Patricia and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a haul video for you. It's just a few things I've picked up. I will have um, a couple more hauls for you coming up soon. Uh, but I wanted to go ahead and haul these things that I've received uh, in the mail. There's, um, I think, see, there's one friend mail. And then one, two other orders. And they're very small. I just got a couple things in, in each order. Uh, first, I'm going to start with friend mail. Uh, my friend Clara, she is here on YouTube. And I will link her channel down below. She did a declutter recently um, of her uh, eyeshadow palettes. And she said in her video, if anybody wanted anything, just to let her know, first come, first serve. Well, I went immediately and I asked her if I could have this palette. I, it just, when I saw her, saw it, I thought, oh, I really like those colors. So she sent it to me. This is the Rose Period palette by Sue Suva Suva. And this is what it looks like. Look at those colors. Those are all my favorites. And I actually have it on now and I did a get ready with me and you will see this in the get ready with me. I use this palette. So there we go. Thank you Clara very much for this palette. I appreciate it. So I'm very happy with that. That's the first thing I've got to show you. Next, I ordered a couple things from um, Sephora. I actually ordered three things, and um, one of the things was uh, out of stock, and so they canceled that portion. So, yeah, I ordered a Huda lipstick, and I think the color I chose was Spring Break, and I guess they sold out of it, so it was marked out of stock and I think it was canceled off my order so I didn't get that lipstick but I did get the um, Huda Beauty Glowish uh, this is her uh, multi dew skin tint foundation and I got the color medium I don't know I've just uh, was been interested lately in foundations and lots of different things is really I've been thinking about getting because I haven't bought a whole lot of makeup in a long time. So this is it. The Glowish in Medium. So let's get some out. I did use this the other day when I went out. And right now it's a little too dark. But I plan on getting more color. I plan on this being the shade I will need. Um, I have no problems with uh, if my foundations don't match because I love to mix. I'll mix a foundation, so I have no problem with that. So, as I open this, I will get rid of excess packaging. There we go. So, there, that is uh, the glowish. So, I'm looking forward to that. The one day I, I, I did put it on and use it, I really liked it. So, and then, second, I got this Saint Tropez self tanning. Purity kit. I have some Saint Tropez self tanner, but I haven't used it now. Uh, I don't know how long. So I don't know if it's any good or not. And I all of a sudden, well, not all of a sudden, but here, I've decided I want to start self tanning again. I want to get some color. So th I thought this one would be good to use to try out. It comes with a mitt, and I do love the mitts. I have a mitt with my other self tanner but this is the water let's see this is the the watery kind or something it's like water it's spray it's the for the body and the face uh, simply apply and glow with just one application of these face and body tanning waters for a gold for a natural golden glow that develops in just four to eight hours and lasts for days no need to rinse, no transfer or stains, no stickiness or streaks. New tropical scent, 100% natural tanning active, 100% clean and vegan friendly. So, that interests me a lot. 
so I can't wait to try these out. I thought I'll give these a shot and see how they do and if I like them, I'll buy the full size. But I think I paid like 25 for that, which is not bad, not bad. So there we go, get that out of my way. And like I said, I ordered a Huda lipstick and that was canceled because it was out of stock. Next, I ordered from uh, Beautylish. And from Beautylish, I ordered a um, Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. I have fallen in love with Charlotte Tilbury lips with uh, Huda and MAC. Those are my favorites, along with Revlon. I also love Revlon lipsticks. So this one I got in Hot Emily. I think that's the color. Yep, Hot Emily. The reason I got this, it, I thought it'd be a pretty coral, but it's actually straight up orange. Look at that. Which I'm okay with that too. I am all right with straight up orange. Here, I'm gonna mix it with what I got on. Makes a really pretty shade. Wipe this off. I don't mind mixing and matching. So there we go. I'm happy with that. Hot Emily. And the other thing, I want to get another wipe because make sure my hands aren't dirty. Um, I got a palette. I got Jeffree Star's new palette. I didn't realize he had a new palette out um, until I started watching some, I had gotten out of watching beauty YouTubers for some reason. I don't know why my, I guess I had house on the brain. So I was looking at people who were decorating their houses and then somehow I got into cooking from there. And then I kind of, I watched my friends on YouTube, but I wasn't watching some of the bigger YouTubers I would always watch. And, um, I don't know, I got out of it. So I started watching beauty YouTubers again, and I saw Jeffree Star came out with a palette, and I didn't realize it. So I got it, Cotton Candy Queen. Now, like with some of my other Jeffree Star palettes, here, that's what it looks like. And his, he's got his picture on this one. Like a lot of the other palettes, this to me is not a standalone palette. I have been in this palette playing. I have used it a couple times already. And I I like his formula. I like the, the eyeshadows. As you can see, they are cotton candy colors. This is a palette I would use with another palette. I would get my pops of color from here and get my neutrals from another palette. Um, my favorite colors so far is Castle of Sprinkles. Now I want to show you see, I hope you can see it's one. There we go. I'm going to stick my finger in it. Look at that. Behind my face. Hopefully that is coming into, into focus for you. Look at that. Go, come on, focus. Come on, look at the glitters. Beautiful, beautiful glitters. Also, this, this color right here is called Lollipop Throat. And it is a real pretty, kind of a, there we go. It's a, peachy pink color. It's just so pretty. This entire palette is just, it's just got pretty pops of color. Um, so like I said, I will be using this one. Let me take the plastic off. Woo! Plastic off the mirror. I will be using this one with other palettes. I have no qualms doing that. Mixing palettes, mixing lips, mixing foundations, <laughs> I do it all the time. So, uh, yeah, for me, this is not a standalone palette. There's no way I would do a standalone eye look using this palette. 
but I knew that when I bought the palette. So, um, yeah. There we go. Jeffree Star's Cotton Candy Queen. Now, with that, I got a free gift. They sent me this as a free gift. This is uh, Jeffree Star's lipstick holder. Let me pull this. You can stick your Jeffree Star lipsticks in it. Right? Well, it's not setting too strong, is it? I don't think that's holding it very well. It's falling over. Where else? Maybe it's these, these lipsticks. Yeah, there we go. They sit right in there. So hopefully other things will too, because I don't have that many Jeffree Star lipsticks. Um, let's see, Jeffree's will fit. Let's see who else I got. Kylie Jenner is too big, uh, too small. Uh, this is Lunar Beauty. Lunar Beauty fits somewhat. That's a Lunar Beauty. Kind of, sort of. Um, Ofra, those are, there's an old Becca. Becca won't fit. Huda won't. Well, yeah, Huda stands up pretty good. It's not the right shape, but I don't know. It was sent to me for free. Let me grab a MAC lip. Look at there. Perfect. Uh, let me grab a Revlon. No. Revlon's too big to fit. The MAC fits. Um, Charlotte Tilbury's too big. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think... Well, MAC fits. But I don't have that many MAC lipsticks either. But there we go. They sent me that for free and I'll figure out something to do with it. So, that's everything in this haul. Like I said, I have ordered from some other things. I ordered a mystery bundle from Ofra. That's coming. I ordered um, what else do I have coming? Is that it? Do I have anything else? That might be it. That might be it. So anyway, when that comes I will show you. But I think that I do have another haul for you uh, I'm going to be filming next that you will see later, and that is going to be a Bath & Body Works haul. So, guys, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, I'd love it if you would subscribe. Any questions or comments, just leave them down below. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. <laughs>